It's been 9 days since Kaka v420 exposed Kofi in a massive video and yet Kofi's channel is still up on YouTube. Huh? That's why in this video we are diving into the reasons why Kofi's YouTube channel may get deleted or may not. But before we jump in, for anyone who just tuning in to this drama, let me give you a quick rundown of how we ended up here. So back in 2021, this Roblox YouTuber named Kaligish found himself in hot water after getting busted for chatting with people under the age of consent. What? And he wasn't just one girl. What? In one situation, Kaligish, who was 20 years old at that time, was reportedly sending creepy messages to a 15 year old girl. Kaligish says, and I quote, you would also be perfect height for some D while on your knees, just saying. And I gotta be honest, knowing she was only 15 and still texting her like that is straight up wild. There was also another time when he was chatting with a 14 year old while he was 18. I was just sent new info regarding a... One sec. Talk, let on me see. Sec. Let me guess. 14 year old? Yeah. I was 17 at the time turning 18 and I broke it off. I already told that all to Koneko and stuff. Was Not new, to mention like... When exchanged with the 14 year old? I was 17 as I said, but yeah, we were. Both sides. All right, all right, all right. So it's still, still illegal. Really? And so after those shady chat logs went public, Kalagush Roblox account, his YouTube channel, and even his Discord were all shut down for good. Then just a month after Kalagush channel got banned, a new Roblox channel was created called Koofy. And this new channel took off like a rocket. I mean, the video editing, the topics were spot on, making it seem like he had done this all before. Did I tell you that some big name Roblox YouTubers were also jumping in to help Koofy? Almost like if they had some kind of connection from a previous life or or maybe even from an old YouTube channel. There is a lot of Roblox YouTubers that not only knew that Koofy was Kalagish, but there are some Roblox YouTubers that helped him get his second channel started. Now fast forward nearly two years, another Roblox YouTuber known as KakaV420, who used to be friends with Koofy, has decided to spill the tea and expose Koofy's secret identity as the infamous Kalagush. I caught you in 4K. So with all this info floating around, Drama Channel and pretty much everyone with a Twitter account went all in, tearing this dude apart. But here's the kicker, his YouTube channel is still up and running, even though he's been labeled as a p and so the real question here, how this dude has not been yetted off the platform yet? Come on now, dawg. You see, YouTube really doesn't want to be seen as a playground for creeps. Because let's be honest, it makes them look bad. So if a bunch of channels start coming after you, YouTube won't think twice about hitting the terminate button on your channel. In fact, YouTube has a strict policy regarding harmful and dangerous individuals, including those involved in a behavior or engaging in inappropriate communication with my but in Kofi's case, YouTube needs enough actual evidence that this channel belongs to Kaligish, despite the fact that larger drama channels have labeled him as a So whether he's actually a it's still up for debate, like nothing has been officially confirmed. Also, think about this for a second. If his channel gets deleted, he may reset his character over and over again, since this guy uses text-to-speech voices, which makes it really hard for everyone to figure out his true identity. Now, you may be thinking, what if this dude may have a friend association that creates a channel for him who's not related to him by blood, and maybe they split some of their revenue? Well, it's possible, but this would still likely violate YouTube's policies. Again, YouTube has this other rule I guess ban invasion, meaning that if a user is banned, they are not allowed to simply create a new channel either by themselves or through a proxy, like a friend or associate. So for those reasons, I'm starting to think this channel may actually stick around. But who knows, YouTube could figure out who he really is and just wipes his channel off the map. Or maybe they don't even care and just decide to give him a second chance. Cause at the end of the day, it's YouTube, anything can happen. But anyways, that's it for me today and I want to thank you guys for watching this whole video. Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.